Following total atomic annihilation, the rebuilding of this great nation of ours may fall to you. That's why we at Vault-Tec have prepared these educational materials for you to better understand the seven defining attributes that make you special. Our topic today is endurance. We will all be faced with many new and unfamiliar health risks, such as infection, sudden loss of limb, and above all, harmful radiation. Fortunately, your formidable endurance has turned your body into a hardworking machine that can resist the harmful effects of radiation and physical violence. Like any machine, then, your body must be well-maintained to stay in tip-top shape. While average Joes will survive on old packaged standbys, your ironclad insides will allow you to seek fresh meat. Radiation poisoning may have enlarged your favorite meals. This means more healthful nutrition for you. Take caution not to bite off more than you can chew. Endurance can also provide new options for food, some of which can be an acquired taste. Gone are the days of exercising for fun. Instead, you will need to combine athletics with crucial survival activities. The greater your endurance, the further you can go. Just be certain to be mindful of others. Build your endurance, and soon you will find ways that it improves your life above ground. Have added confidence in the swimming pool, can stronger, more resilient limbs to keep the flesh of your fellow man can provide. Regularly study your Vault Tech provided materials to prepare for survival. And to answer the question, do you know what makes you special? my great-great-grandfather serving in the army wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen he got his wish when the US ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki the world awaited Armageddon Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, 21st century. People awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. 
Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. Never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the veterans hall tonight, hun. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Hey, my turn, big guy. Let me just slide in here. Huh? Why don't you see if breakfast is ready? I wonder what Sean will grow up to be. Huh. How'd you get on the floor, Mr. Bear? Can't wait to teach him to ride this. <laughs> the glove's a little big right now, but Sean will grow into it. <laughs> He'll either be great at spelling or great at smashing blocks together.
We really need to get those vacation photos developed. Another fine product of General Atomics International. Yeah, let Codsworth take care of it. Abraxo for all your cleaning needs. Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Nuka Cola. Ice cold. Looks like the milk got delivered. Saddle up Salisbury steak. Graded A. Plus. <laughs> How can someone so small oh, drink like so much? I shall attend to young Shaw. <laughs> you know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. But then we're looking at a cold front coming down from Canada, making it crisp and dry for next week's Halloween festivities. Looking in on next week's forecast, we have a high of 52 on Monday. But also appear our troops stationed overseas are experiencing some unusual weather as well. On the island of Mamba Jiao, the nights are cold, unseasonably so for Southeast Asia. But for the 5th Infantry, that's... Now who left those here? An autumn jamboree. All the easier for our mechanized healthcare mm. to drive any screaming... More the same. Beanies. Can you get that? It's probably that salesman. He comes for you every day. Never gonna find that dog. Swatting sultans will swing the fences. Led by star pitcher Matt the Missile Murtaugh. Good old USA. Just answer the door and he'll go away. I'm so proud of her. Good morning! Vault Tech calling. Go on. Nice to find you, sir. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Then I'm glad you caught up with me. Oh, me too. You have no idea. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a... Uh, mm -hmm. Precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Sounds great. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of... <clears throat> Total atomic annihilation. <laughs> I just need to verify some information. That's all.
Sure, let's do it. Splendid! Splendid. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Sean has been changed. But he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> you heard Codsworth. Go on. But then we're looking at a cold front coming down from Canada, making it crisp and dry for next week's Halloween. How are the two most important men in my life doing? in the mobile a bit. He loves that. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Followed by, yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes, sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with say? our affiliate stations. We do, oh, we no. do have, we do have coming in. That's um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my god. We we need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Excuse me. We're coming! Don't close them all without us! All vault participants, check in at the gate! 
That's absurd! I am Not on the Vault list. Tech. You don't get in. I'm going in. You can't stop it! Oh, God. Oh, 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 God, okay, oh, God, okay. Oh, God. I'm reporting this! If you're in the program, step forward. Otherwise, return home! Hey there. Are they letting you in here. and not me? Oh God, we're gonna die. Someone's gonna hear about no, this. You're registered. If you, we need to get in. They have we're to. on the list. Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. Head to Good the elevator. You two, follow me. God Come on. What's gonna happen to all those people outside we're the gate? We're doing everything we can. Now keep moving. On the platform in the center. <laughs> Sir, we need to send you down to the vault. Step on the hey. platform. Sir, I need to operate the elevator. Get out of the control room. Send it down. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh, oh my god! Now, now! Send it down now! Hold on! Can't this thing move faster? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god! We did it. We made it. We're okay. Hey, that was a nuke. A goddamn Everyone, nuke. Everyone, please, step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. Hey we'll there. get everyone situated we, in your new home. We just need a minute. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later... Excuse me. No, no. We don't. What? Don't get caught up thinking what, about what's that. What's going on? You're safe now. Everyone, hey there. just head up oh. these stairs oh my and through the door there. Okay. I can't stop shaking. Hey there. <laughs> please keep moving. Up the stairs and through the door. Take a seat. This way, please. Vault Tech is well, here yeah. for you. Pick up a suit. All new residents. There you are. Please Put proceed in an orderly fashion. Just this way. Levels are good. Welcome home. Male. Right over there, please. Female and over there. Good. Take a suit. Take a vault suit, then head down the hall. Hey there. We're all right. Thank God. One vault suit. Now just head Excuse down the me. hall. We've been waiting forever. Hey there. Each of There's you some problem with our luggage. They're, they're telling suits. us to wait. Just step over to the tail. Yeah, looks fine. It's uh, down the hallway right thanks. there. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. See? This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. It's gone. Our home. Everything we Sir? had. My mother and father down in D.C. Hey there. Oh, Move God, along. Honey, what if they didn't make it? I know this is a difficult time, but Vault Tech will be with you every step of the way. You'll thrive here. How, how long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. It's a good fit. Just checking everyone the off Vault the list as they come in. Fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for you the all future, right? right? It's gonna be okay, right? 
such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Hey, that elevator, so slow. Just step in here and put your vault suit on. Shh. It'll be okay. Daddy's right here. See? Honey, <clears throat> could you... Who's my little guy? I'm not going far. I'll just be over there. There he is. See? Daddy's not going far. All set? Just step inside and put on your vault suit. Everything okay? I think he's better. You go ahead. The pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. <sighs> Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals, normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three, two, one. has to be a release! Come on, come on, come on! Oh, God! I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise.
giant roaches? What the hell? here. Where is everyone? Is this all that's left?
Is anyone alive? Did anyone get out? Everyone's dead.
as I live and breathe. Oh, it's, it's really you. Codsworth? You're, you're still here. So, other people could still be alive, too. But of course I'm still here. Surely you don't think a little radiation could deter the pride of General Atomics International? <laughs> but you seem the worse for wear. Best not let the wife see you in that state, hmm? Where is the missus, by the way? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Sean's been kidnapped, but I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. Mm -hmm. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car, the car, how do you polish rust? What do you know, Codsworth? Uh, I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were dead. I did find this hollow tape. I believe the missus was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. A holotape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that pip boy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The missus and young Sean may turn up yet. Have you seen anything dangerous? Oh, just the usual, sir. Pesky neighborhood dogs and mosquitoes. Shall I investigate? All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, sir. Picking up peekaboo! Senses are picking up movement in another house. Follow me. Terrific. <laughs> 
It's a fight, then! He isn't here either. They're, they're really gone, aren't they? Come on, Codsworth. I need your help. Where can I go? Well, you could head into the city. Concord is nearby. But the people there are mm, as put together as I am. Thanks for your help, Cosworth. Good luck, sir. You'll find young Sean. I know you will. I shall remain here and secure the home front.
No, no, no. Little fingers away. There we go. Okay. Just say it. Right there. Right there. <laughs> Yay. Hi, honey. Listen. I, I don't think that Sean and I need to tell you how great of a father you are. But we're going to anyway. Isn't that right? You are kind and loving. <laughs> Funny. That's right. And patient. So patient. Patience of a saint, my mom used to say. Look, with Sean and us all being home together, it's been an amazing year. But even so, I know our best days are yet to come. Mm. There'll be changes, sure. Things we need to adjust to. You'll rejoin the civilian workforce, and I'll shake the dust off my law degree. But everything we do, no matter how hard, we do it for our family. Now, say goodbye, Sean. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Come on. <laughs> Bye, honey. We love you. Coming, buddy. <laughs>